Hi, I'm Amber from wonderbaby.org and I wanted to talk to you today about Bollyland Magic App, which is from Sano Kids. And this is an app that's been designed specifically for young children with vision impairment so they can learn and practice their first navigational touch gestures for voiceover, which is Apple's built-in screen reader. The beauty about this app is that it's a game, so while your kids are playing with the game, they're actually learning the fundamental skills they're going to need to use a mobile touch screen device. And I wanted to show you how this works. First of all, you have to know there's a story. So we have the Bollylanders, which are characters. Each of them is a ball. They live in Bollyland, and they're going to put on a magic show. So in scene one, they're preparing for the show. So let's open up scene one and you see that there are multiple levels. There are multiple levels in, in these different scenes. Each level teaches them a new gesture, a new way to interact with the iPad. I'm gonna skip up to level two. In level one, you learn how to drag your finger across the screen and locate each of the characters on stage. So let's see what happens in level two. Now you know where each Borley lander is. They would like to say hi to you. Finger drag to find each of them again and then double tap on the screen to say hello. You need to greet each Borley lander at least two times to get to the next level. You can start when I say now. Now. So the first thing I want to point out in this level is that obviously you don't need any vision at all to play this app and that actually it's a lot of fun for me to play it with my eyes closed. And the second thing is that there's a storyline, so you listen to the narrator, you understand that they're characters, they're on the stage, we have to locate them and get them to say hi to us, but that there's also pretty precise directions that we have to follow about what type of gestures we're going to be making and when we're allowed to touch the screen. And obviously for our kids, all of our kids, it's important for them to learn how to follow directions, but it's really important for them to learn how to listen and follow directions if they're going to be interacting with the assistive technology like voiceover. So let me show you how this works. I'm going to drag my finger across the screen. Here is Wheelie. Double tap to say hello. And when my finger comes in contact with one of the hidden characters, I'm given the directive to double tap to say hello. So let me double tap. Howdy. I am Wheelie. Here is Wheelie. Double tap to say hello. And if I keep moving across the screen... Here is Squeaky. Double tap to say hello. G'day, I'm Squeaky. Here is Squeaky. Double tap to say hello. I can find all of the characters on the screen just by dragging my finger around until I've located a character and then double tapping to get them to say hello, which is exactly how a child would interact with say the home screen using voiceover, dragging to locate the different apps on the home screen, and then double tapping when they want to open that app. So this game is teaching them how to do those gestures and how to interact with their iPad. If I go back to the main menu, you can see how in each of these different levels in scene one, we're learning new ways to drag our fingers, tap, scene two, one finger flick, one finger flick and a double tap. There are different gestures that you learn as you progress through the game until you get to the end of the game, which is scene four, the magic show, and then you have to do all of them in order to see the characters put on the show. So I'm just gonna show you the beginning of scene four, the magic show. The Borley Landers have happily practiced and rehearsed. Now they can hardly wait to perform in the magic show. There will be lots of music and fun acts, but they need your help to run the show. It is time to use the magic skills that you have learnt. The acts can only start after you make magic happen. Borleycopter performs the first act. Listen closely to what you need to do. Enjoy the show. Explore the screen. Finger drag to where Borleycopter is. When he says hi, do a quick, light, one-fingered double tap to start the first act in the show. You can start when I say now. Now. 
and I'm not going to do it because I want there to be a surprise for you to find out what the magic show is actually like and it actually is really cute and fun. Um, but at this point in the game you get to use all of the skills you've learned through all of the other levels to put on the show because you are part of the show. The player is part of the show. It's really cute, it's really sweet, and you actually do learn a lot about how to use accessibility and voiceover in iOS devices. So I hope you check it out. Thanks.